We are. Uh, we are hosting a free event at Muskoka Heritage Place, which is Pioneer Village. Uh, the event starts at noon and goes until 4 p.m. Uh, uh, snowshoeing, hot chocolate, we're going to have some activities for the kids, uh, campfire with marshmallows, just really encouraging people to come out, enjoy the outdoors and spend time with family without any charge. Well, let's talk about, um, now is this the first year that we're doing this, the Rotary is doing this? This is actually our second okay, year. Okay. We, two years ago, actually almost three years ago now, we did uh, a family day at Can Lake. Mm -hmm. However, the past two years, Mother Nature has not cooperated, so we've had to cancel the event. This year, we decided instead of relying on Mother Nature uh, and, and hoping for ice, let's try another plan and Muskoka uh, Heritage Place is there. Uh, so we've been speaking with Ron Goslin and, and working together and thought it would be a great venue and, and just to be able to provide the snowshoeing uh, as a trail through uh, Pioneer Village. Just something very different and we did not have to worry about ice, which in this case it is there this yeah. year, but uh, that's okay. We're, we are telling people while it's not associated with us to if they bring their skates, they can, you know, the, the lake is there, but our mm -hmm. event is specific to snowshoeing, marshmallows, campfire, uh, hot dogs, we're having barbecued hot dogs, so yeah. It seems that, you know, the Rotary Club does, you know, so many great things in our community. And in, in particular, I know we can talk about Family Day, but in a grander scope as well. Why the Rotary feels it's so important to offer this type of activities, especially Family Day, how it's free of charge and other activities, too. You can mention why they find it so important that we provide this for the community. I believe in this day and age, uh, people are looking for more opportunities that engage family. It doesn't matter the, the age per se, obviously budget uh, concerns mm -hmm. as well. Uh, uh, so there, these are the types of things that uh, Rotary wants to promote a family friendly environment, uh, whether it's family day or dog fest. Mm -hmm. uh, we're being a part of the Maple Fest this year with the pan offering the pancake breakfast. So everything we do, we have family in mind. And many of the Rotarians, uh, you know, we have families of, of our own. So we're always thinking of ways we can be inclusive to people in our community. Well, okay, well, you know, and speaking of inclusivity, I mean, the Rotary Club are, uh, let's just move right in, are, are always looking for memberships and people to take part and participate in some sort of way. So for anybody watching right now, how can one participate, whether it's to become a member or to volunteer at an event? How do they mm -hmm. do that? Like, what can they do? Well, I mean, we're always... Uh eager to have volunteers come and help and 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 part of that is, is seeing us at these events like family day maple fest dog fest we have people participating that aren't even Ro rotarians and offer their help so they've become friends of rotary mm -hmm. we find that that's actually a great introduction to learn more about what rotary is all about and whether it's not it's going to be a good fit for that person mm -hmm. so I would say, yeah, definitely come out to some of our events. We have we meet every Wednesday at Boston Pizza for lunch. Public is more than welcome. They're not closed meetings. Uh, uh, Twelve fifteen to one thirty, Boston Pizza every Wednesday lunch, with the exception of uh, every the first Wednesday of every month is an evening meeting. Mm -hmm. But yeah, just come out and say hi to us at these events, and we'd be more than happy to to let you know a little bit more about uh, the good works of Rotary. Awesome. Well, I want to thank you so much for taking the time to speak with us about this. So just to, just to recap, um, so it is family day from what time to what time? And, and, and it's completely free. So what do people have to bring anything at all or? So it's Monday, mm -hmm. February 19th from 12 to 4 at Muskoka Heritage Place, also known as, as uh, Pioneer Village. Mm -hmm. There's lots of parking there. You'll see us uh, from Brunel that you're not going to be able to miss us. <laughs> Uh, dress warmly mm -hmm. uh, and we provide the snowshoes so you don't need to bring bring those just bring yourselves and we'll have drinks we'll have the hot dogs we'll have the marshmallows and yeah just uh, from 12 to 4 on Monday perfect